<laughs> That's mine. Good choice. Good choice. Shout out to you guys. I'm recording you. super fun video. We're taking all the supercars out to a car show. Um, and it, the car show is a classic car show. So we're gonna take all the supercars out over there. I'm actually sponsoring the event, giving out an award. And uh, just see what the people think that like classic car shows. We kind of crash it with our supercars. Not really, I'm sure everybody likes supercars too. But um, yeah, it's gonna be fun. We got a bunch of people here. We're all gonna go over together and uh, I'm just gonna film a classic Camp PC vlog for you. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. All right, Phil told me I missed the cold Make start. Make sure you get this one first. Of the M235i. <laughs> Here we go. Make sure you get that one first, okay? Nice, hey, well done. So the other ones sound better. <laughs> All right, so Alex is taking the Corvette. We're gonna put Carly in there with him. Hello, is this your first time in a supercar? No. You've driven in supercars? So Alex, you haven't driven this yet, right? No, I haven't. You drove my R8, but not this. Okay. Yeah. So drive, you pull back for. Cool. Um, that's your uh, modes. You turn that, and it'll put you in different modes. I'd put it in sport mode right now if you twist it one time to the right. That's all you really need. If you want to go paddle shifts, Alex, you just start using them. Yeah. Okay. And then automatic. after seven seconds, if you don't use them, it'll go back to regular. Right. Just remember that. Very cool. Yeah. So that's that's it. All right. I'll follow you. Yeah. Sweet. Keep up. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> And then Tina Wieners is taking the GTR Pro. All of our cars actually just got ceramic coated by uh, Brandon and Ben at West Shore Auto Center. And I, <laughs> I was leaning against this one the other day, the actually, putting I gas see in it. Where you have a mark? Yeah. Okay, sorry. See your butt no, mark. Lean, a lot. lean against it's that. It's all covered with pollen, well, and now it's your butt. Okay, calm down. <laughs> um, this has a PPF, but we ceramic coated over it. I mentioned it in the other channel or in the other video, but um, it's so slippery now. It's amazing. When you drive, it like cleans the car, just the air going over it. But teens are gonna ride in the GTR. Reese, you're going with teens in the yeah. GTR. Have you been in that yet? Oh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> okay, good luck. And then Phil's taking his M235i with Broski. Look at him in there. There's my brother. <laughs> Say hi to the YouTube fam. You excited, Tino? Yeah. You got stuck with Phil. <laughs> and then me and Dado are gonna be in my R8. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Got the cars posted up over yonder. Last year they had us parked down there, but um, obviously we're not putting our cars in the show because this is a classic car show. But there is a ton of cars here. I guess people that are just coming to hang out and then cars that are actually in the show. So we're supposed to walk around and um, choose a car since we sponsored the event. Um, and like, I think a lot of the money goes towards like local firefighters and like other local people here <clears throat> in the town. So um, we gotta go look at the cars, choose a favorite car. I think I actually have to pre present an award. So that'll be interesting. But um, yeah, it looks like a great turnout. It's not raining, so that's freaking awesome. Phil, how did it feel to get smacked down by the R8? I didn't see that. You didn't? What are you talking about? <laughs> Tino. You you didn't Tino. How bad did I smack him down? Oh, dude, he pulled on you so oh, hard. Get out! Are you out of your butt? He off the gas so you could catch up. So you didn't get it on camera, did you? Oh yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> 
And then Teens and I did a little pool too, but it's hard because we, we can't talk to each other, so we don't really I know when. One, I saw a dotto I did, yeah. And then I saw you yeah. do one, two, and I was like, oh shit. Yeah. And I put my foot down, and I looked down, and I'm like, I'm in comfort. <laughs> Of course. Yeah, I was also I was in Nico Pro mode. Um, whenever. Yeah. Raced, mis yeah excuses, Pro. excuses. He likes to race us when he's all ready to go and we're not. Well, I let people go first. Do you see me? I was telling you to go. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then I'll go after that because yeah, yeah. I want to see what happens. Oh yeah, yeah. You can still tell. Like, I think I was reeling you in, team. You did take off though. It was it was very close, and then I took off. But then there was a car in front of me, so I yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready. We'll have to go back and look at the footage because you know we, I filmed Let's it. Let's be honest, I didn't have any illusions that I was beating the RA. <laughs> no, but I just wanted to see what it would be like. You know what I mean? Yeah. So here's all, all the awards, and there's ours right there. YouTuber favorite by Jarrett and Christina. Langen's awards over there as well. Langen Financial. These look really really nice. So that's what that's what we're choosing right now. We're gonna choose our YouTuber's favorite award. Right. So we gotta go walk down the uh, the aisles here and. Uh, she was in a war, but it's an awesome turnout. Like, there's a ton of freaking cars. They got live music, they got drinks, and uh, food trucks. Yep. Yeah, everything you, everything you could ever want. Dude, Dude I love the color on this Chevelle right here. Look at that Malibu. Oh, man. El Camino. Uh, don't forget, we're here. This is epic, the Halifax Fire Department. Yeah, Lowersburg see? Ferry. There you go. So, we're Appreciate supporting a bunch of local organizations. Thank you very much. Yeah, so I'm just going to walk around, I'll show you guys all the cars. Um, or actually, we'll show you guys ones that we really, really like, and then we'll go from there. What? Oh yeah, Porsche GT2 RS. That's really nice. I don't think we can give that to. I don't think we can give an award to that for a classic car show. I mean, we could. You know what I mean? I guess we could. It has classic design. <laughs> That's true. Teens, what do you think people would do if we gave this the the award at the classic I car think show? They would love it. You think is that it, Phil? I think it's faster than everything here. <laughs> no, it's not. It's a model. Yes, it is. It's a Model Three. Oh, okay, never mind. Get out of here. Or actually, maybe it is a. What no, is it's it? A three. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, there's a ton of cool cars. Actually, there's a vet over there I want to look at. It looks really freaking sick. sick. Trucks are pretty cool. That's almost as buggy up here. That's taller you than out teen. This dune buggy. Look at oh, that. that's pretty pimp, dude. The buggy. Dude, there's some really cool cars. There's a vet. Another Corvette C8. Yeah. Look at this thing, huh? This is pretty cool. Imagine. This might be the most fun thing here. Imagine dude. ripping around. It's got this. bucket seats in it. Really, you gotta sit in the back. Dude, that's <laughs> yeah. No, that's for all your beers, see? <laughs> Just fetal position in the back. Yeah. What do you think of this guy? That the Pontiac cool. Star Chief. I like it it's so hey, long. Dude, you wanna I, turn some heads? Yeah, I'd roll around in this. That is beautiful. I wonder if this is original paint and everything. Look at this. Damn, that's beautiful. Okay, I think this is my favorite so far. Alex just said, Alex just said, can you imagine parallel parking that thing? Did you? Yeah. Where is it? It's down here. Tino, I can see you rolling around in this. Star Chief? No. <laughs> no. Look at this. We've got a Ford 1929 Model A. That is epic. Doesn't your neighbor in, Cal in Cali have one of these? Yeah, he's something that's so weird. I think his is even older, actually. That is so cool. That is actually really cool. It already won something. Yeah. But but can it win two or is it only allowed to win one? We should pick oh, something guess, that hasn't won anything maybe. Oh, here we go. A 1966 Chevy Stingray. Dude. Okay. I think this is my favorite. Turbo Yeah, 427. Yeah. Look at that, dude. What a long way they've come. Uh-huh. This is dope, dude. Look at the interior. The green. It's a four speed. That is so cool. Look how short the seats are. I like this. Air conditioned. <laughs> Dude, I really like this. That's awesome. And then here's a 1968 Corvette. That's really nice too. It's crazy how much different this one looks from just two years prior, the one we were just looking at. Yeah, like there's no, like, Dude. All the and everything. Wow. Yeah. So crazy. This is sick. And they're all manuals. Look at that. That's a five speed now. They went to a five speed. Look how big the gauges are. I hope you brought your cassettes. <laughs> Dude, that's cool. Okay. Man, I love the old school Corvettes. We need to get one of those someday. And here we go. We come to the 1971 Chevy El Camino. Tino wrote a song about an El Camino. It's called Funky why the, El Camino. Why the by F? The way. Is everybody got to make fun of my car truck? Why the fuck? <laughs> everybody got to make fun of my car truck. That's pretty epic. Didn't, didn't our pops have one of these? I'm pretty sure our dad did at some point. Look at this. Yeah, I mean, it's got everything you need, you know? It's got a bed. Yeah. You can have a lot of sex in there. Exactly. I'd put a mattress in it, though. Yay. Okay, so that's definitely on the list. All right, so after much deliberation between this and the Star Chief, 
we decided to go with the 66 Corvette because Christina's owned two Corvettes in her life. Yeah, she's a Corvette girl. So we're putting down the information. We're gonna put a sticky on there. It already won somebody else's award as well. But look at that, it's an all original car, teens. That's pretty cool. So yeah, there you go. The 1966 Chevy Corvette Stingray. Did you show the interior Yeah, I did earlier. All right, yeah. here we go. You gonna put it on there? The officials. Congratulations. Emblem. You got the YouTuber award. The most coveted award no, in history. No, that's stuck. And then she just. No, it's fine. Boom. Congratulations. <laughs> You're welcome. American James Bond. Car there it award. is. That's exactly this is what American James Bond. Would that's drive. what it is. Yep. That's. Oh, I would love to have one of these. We gave that. This got our award. The YouTuber award. What'd you give in your suit? I got mine. The SS. The SS. Oh, com the Camaro. Yeah. That is very nice. Very nice. Alex was about What's to that? give the award oh, nice. car. I said I like. And then I was like, it's a car truck. And he's like, oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, Alex from Langen Financial Group, my esteemed financial advisor, has chosen to go with the AMX. AMX. Right there. there. Yes. Boom. There awesome. Yeah, good Got choice. It. Good choice. That thing is badass. There you go. Good choice. <laughs> We're checking out. We're still here checking out cars. This is a 1941 Plymouth. I don't know P11 something or other, but I was saying these look like the ones from like the Dick Tracy movies and shit. Look at what that thing. Just say it on camera. What? Because I've been saying, and I can stop saying it. They don't make, they don't grills. make grills like they used to. <laughs> they don't make grills like they used to. <laughs> oh. Look at the grill game back then. Zing. Yeah. yeah. Looks like a juicy booty, doesn't it? Look at that. Like a heart shaped booty. They knew, they knew what they were doing. Hey, rev that. Oh my god, that's epic. Thank you, brother. All right, so we actually have to pick another car because you can't pick a car that already has a sticker on it. So now we're back to square one. We gotta go find another car to put a sticker on. All right, well, Tino was right from the beginning when he wrote his El Camino song, Funky El Camino. The Funky El Camino does not have an award. That's number three. It does now. The YouTuber, the coveted YouTuber award goes to the 1971 Chevy El Camino SS. We're gonna throw a, a mattress back here and we're gonna bang in this car right now. Since we don't have a sticker anymore. Oh, there goes the bet that we tried to give her an award to, but this is a this is a great second option. There you go. And now it has a smiley face. Hopefully people will know. They're probably gonna leave and not even know they won the coveted the best award here. Hey, so Sean he's the one who put on the Coleman Classic, and that's his El Camino. He goes, You're not allowed to choose his car. Can you win? I can. Okay, yeah, you won, buddy. Have the YouTubers pick, especially Oh, there you go. Hey, congrats, brother. That's amazing. You're welcome. So people always tell me to buy a Porsche. This is one of the only Porsches I like. GT2 RS. Actually, I like the GT3 RS as well. But these are nasty. And they make like, I want to say 700 horsepower or something. Isn't that sick? Yeah, these are just straight up race cars. Look at all that Alcanta Alcantara. They're gonna be, I believe, redoing this very soon, and this will get updated, but yeah, carbon hood, beautiful center lock wheels. They're probably forged, super lightweight. They're, he's running, he's playing a dangerous game here, this guy. <laughs> but yeah, that thing is epic. Look at the size of the wing, beautiful. You wanna stand by the back, bud. You guys are gonna choose your favorite, all right? You're gonna tell YouTube your favorite. All right. All right, so after the three cars, what, which one's your favorite? All of you guys? Really, you too? You didn't hear the other ones. <laughs> All right, hey, that's mine. Good choice, good choice. <laughs> Shout out to you guys. All right, we got a future car enthusiast here. What's his name? Patrick. Patrick is gonna hop in the R8. Look, he's like, how do I get in this thing? You can go in. Daddy, help you? He can climb all over, it's all good. It's just an Audi. Can he reach the pedals? <laughs> he's gotta somehow, you gotta touch the brake in it in order to turn it on. Yeah, you 
Reach in there. And then have him press that start stop button there. Can you press this button? Press that button, bud. Ooh. Look at that. <laughs> you like it? He likes it. Push the pedal. Let's see his reaction. <laughs> hey, great job, buddy. High five. <laughs> All right, we're saddling up. Teens and uh, Reese are back in the GTR. I got Broski with me in the R8. And then Alex and Dotto are in the uh, vet. And then Phil and Carly are in the BMW. This is what it's all about right here. Oh yeah, all right, let's get out of here. I'm recording you, recording me. Filming, but we were going down the mountain. Alex went by like five cars yeah. in a in a no passing zone. We were in Mexico though, so it was totally legal. <laughs> we arrived to Tequila Willie's. We're gonna go inside and uh, see what's going on. All right, we got a nice little indoor outdoor table going on. We picked up some river rocks. Fun fact: they actually hand pick these straight out of the the river right there. That's how they get them. They bring them in here. They throw some marinara and garlic on it, and we eat them up. Uh, I'm doing a Moscow mule. We got numerous drinks around the table. Hey, cheers to a successful car show. Alex didn't die and wreck our Corvette, so that's good. <laughs> Thanks for coming, guys. <laughs> so, this would happen after we get our cars detailed and ceramic coated. The first day we take them out to a car show, it storms on us. And it's gonna be, look at the size of these droplets. Now, the ceramic coat hopefully should help keep the car cleaner. Um, and actually, I'm gonna have my wheels ceramic coated and all of the windows of my car, including the windshield and all that too, so this will roll off a lot more. But it'll be interesting to see what the car looks like after a rainstorm and the ceramic coat, so we'll check it out when we get back home. There's Alex, back with the vet. So he's gonna be dropping that off, heading back home in his Volkswagen. He, like, he has plenty of money to buy a cool car. I don't know why he's driving that thing around. Right, roast him in the comment section below, please. Um, but yeah, I'm home. Teens is, uh, dropping Reese off at the house. I think they're coming back. We're gonna go jam on some music downstairs, my brother and I. Um, or maybe we'll play some cornhole out back since it's actually beautiful outside. Look at that freaking thing, dude. That thing looks like a Batmobile. Such a beautiful car. What do you think, bud? It's awesome. incredible, so fun. Hell so yeah. Fun. It looks so good, dude. And it sounds amazing. My brother was telling me, I didn't realize. Did you see, I thought that kid was, I thought the, Mom was trying to film the kid's reaction to my car, and apparently she was trying to take a photo take a of him. Of it, yeah. And then I revved the car, and he started crying <laughs> and ran off. Whatever. I had no idea. I mean, I was revving all the cars, so I thought, like, you know what I mean? It might there might be a clip of it. I don't know. I think Phil might have been filming. I think the craziness. Anyway, Alex, thanks for coming, bud. Awesome. Yeah, so yeah. fun. Gotta Good get to soccer. See you. There you go. See you guys. Gonna go do Dude, kid stuff. Thanks for not yeah. filming. Yeah. What a great time. <laughs> the final car has arrived. The GTR Pro. I don't know why, I think this one might be my favorite looks wise, but the R8 is definitely my, my favorite to drive. This is a close second. You hear those carbon ceramics squeaking? <laughs> oh my God, it's so ridiculous. That's the one issue with carbon ceramics. They're made for track, not for like normal everyday driving around use. How was it? It was good. Yeah? A lot of people staring at this car. Someone, her son Nate's friend, Snapchatted him a photo of us at a stoplight. Oh really? Just that's yeah. funny. You can't get away with anything First in these cars. Time, you can't get away yeah. With Epic. Let's go play some cornhole and drink. Now it's a party, baby. Look at this. He's got chubbies. Jair Bear's got chubbies. Yeah. Matching. Team chubby. We're gonna do some some cornhole tournaments. I got my ass kicked by her and him the other day. But we got the waterfall on. Oh, he's going in. The pool's 70, I think. So it shouldn't be too bad. I Phil, the hot tub's on, by the way. So you're good. And it's supposed to be a, a thunderstorm, so I want you to stay in there and take a bowl of lightning for YouTube. <laughs> Check this dive out, ready? You got, you got it. Jackknife. Ah! <laughs> that hurt. You have such problems. Is it cold? Flawless, right? Is it cold? How was my splash? It was, pretty, it was good. It got, it got my chubbies wet. Pretty minimal splash? I've never had a man get my chubby wet. 
I'm all chubbed up, baby. Let's play some porno. <laughs> We First game, we made short work. Team Chubbies. Team Chubbs. Team Chubbies made Look short work of Dotto and Carly. Sorry, sorry. Now we're gonna put a smackdown on Tino. Uniforms. Tino and uh, teams. Show them the uniforms, bro. Tino and teams. I showed them earlier. Oh, okay. He's had a couple drinks. We'll, uh, we'll let it slide. All right, team. Team Chubby. Rain victorious yet again. Well, we went to 21. Play by house rules because they're too much of a. I thought it was just get to 21. I can't help it. I just put it in the hole. You know what I mean? with the black. Here we go. All right. There we go. Get it. Get it. Get it. Loser jumps in the pool. Teens. Loser jumps in the pool. There was never that bad. Yeah, I just made it up. You can't do win by two also, right? No. Uh uh. It's just if you want to play. Yeah. That game we were playing just get to 21 or more. It doesn't matter. Normally we play. You have to get actually 21. Yeah. Which makes it more interesting. What do people think though on the channel? Like, what, yeah. How do you guys play? The best way to play it is it first one at 21 or is it win at 21? 21. Yeah. I think you have to try and then, at 21. It's just more strategy. It's more pressure. But it takes longer, and if there's people waiting to play. Exactly. And then also. Well, if you're good at it, then you'd win at 21. <laughs> if you but if you go over 21, where do you go back to? Do you go back to 11? Yeah, but you go back what to I'm 16? saying is. Do it. Do it. I think you go back to 13. If you can't tell, we're all athletes. We're very competitive. You go back I say to back to 11. I say 13. back to 11. Okay, 11? All right, fine. Let's do it. Let us know how you guys play in the comments. Meanwhile, we got this going on downstairs. Right? Well, Dotto and I just lost to Teens and Carly, so we figured let's drown our sorrows in some whiskey. So this is Dotto's Smoked Whiskey Kits. If you guys don't know about these kits, you should totally go check out his website because he hand builds all of this shit. So what we're going to do is take a little Dotto made lid off, pull out a glass, another glass, and we're going to pour some Glenfiddich 15 in there, Ooh. and we're going to smoke this bitch. And as, it, as is customary in the Campisi household, I gotta add this to my collection. These are bottles I've drank in the past, in the past few months. <laughs> I might have a problem, so we're gonna pour some Glenfiddich in there. Oh, by the way, if you guys want smoke whiskey kits for yourselves, you can go to dottomade.shopify. I will have links to Dotto's Instagram in the description below and pick up some custom smoked whiskey kits for yourself. Go ahead and pour that in there. The only reason we're using ice is because it helps draw the smoke down whenever we smoke it. Oh yeah. So now we throw this puppy on here. We get some hickory wood chips. They're my favorite. We pinch it and then we smoke it. So you just take a lighter and you light that shit on fire. And look at that. Oh, that's so epic. Smoke just billow billowing in. Okay, hold on. Let me finish this clip. And then once we fill them with smoke, we put the Dotto made custom lids on there. Look at that. Give it a little. Mine got, mine got even smokier, look. Mm -hmm. That's so epic. So we're gonna let it marinate a little bit. Just let the flavors marinate. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn this camera around and show you what we're working with here. Look at this, this is what I have to deal with. Look, there you go. You're welcome, YouTube. Welcome to our life. Look at him. Sexy, is this sexy? Oh God, yeah. I'm rock hard. All right, we have 21 right now. We're, 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 we're putting father and son to bed. Phil, throw it away. Throw it away, Phil. Perfect. Nate has to put it on the board or we win. Nate, this is the first time you ever hear me say this. It's a hole. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. We go on. All right, so Nate brought him back. I put one on the board. We have 21 right now. I can't put this on the board, so I gotta do this. And now it's on Father Bear. Tino Bobino, does he have it in him? Does he have it? Here we go. Can he put it on the board? Wow, we go to another round. Well, I didn't film it, but uh, this was the situation. We had 20, they had four on the board, I had two, so a hole wins it, and you know what Jared Bear did. One Yats of these bad boys. Yahtzee! So my brother and his family were sitting over there at the hot tub, which is being heated right now. We have a propane tank back there. And they were like, we're smelling propane. Dotto just fixed the fireballs. They were leaking last year. Now that one's leaking again. And our propane's down by like 40%, which is not good. 
So Dotto's gonna have to fix that for us. But in the meantime, we shut off the valve right there. And these guys are doing dippies. Show, them a, show us a dippy. Oh, that was actually pretty good. That was pretty good. Yeah. Tino, do the one. Tino, do the one you just did. Yeah, do that one. <laughs> That's amazing. The pool, how's the pool water? I want more. I want to do more. Not bad. Not bad? Especially when I know I can go get it now. Yeah, exactly. So pool's probably 73. We got that heated up to about 95. So it's like bath water. Go from this to that. Back to this. We're doing cold treatment. Yeah, do it. 360 Dippy. 360 Dippy. Aww. What do you got for us, Phil? Oh, okay. A little front flippy? Not oh, bad. That was fine. Are you gonna hit a diffy? Or a 360? 360 diffy. Don't hit the side of the pool. I feel like this should be a little bit bigger right here, but that's fine. 360 diffy. Yeah, baby! Yeah! <laughs> nice! Look who I found, the Oro baby. Oh, you're running from me? Oro! Come here, bud. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you haven't seen anybody all day. Oh no, you're throwing up on camera now? That's what you're doing? They're gonna think that you have problems, bud. What are you doing? Oh, there goes Oro. No. Oh no, he's throwing up. He was probably eating grass, that freaking idiot. Good job, I don't even feel bad for you. All right, ordered some food. Went with some wingy poos. Not sure what that is. Oh, that's definitely buffalo right there. We got some cheese sticks, we got some fries. Oh, we got some pizza. So I, I always like the uh, pepperoni, onion, and olive. Look at that. What's in this one? Calzone. Oh my God, we have so much food. This is how we stay fit. I haven't ate all day. That's a long. bully. That's a bully. That's 100% a bully. <laughs> you know where that's going. In my belly. In Look how epic the pool looks at night. We got the light changing, color changing lights on. We just turned the spa off. We had that thing on all day long. Normally we can put the fireplaces on, but since one of them's leaking propane, we can't do that right now. It never ends. We've got our outdoor floodlights on, but um, <laughs> there's a party going on over here. Apparently like 16 year old's birthday. Happy birthday, whoever you are, if you see this video ever. Um, we're gonna light off some fireworks. So Phil and Dotto are out there in the middle of the yard and they're gonna do some, uh, some fireworks. So I think, figured that would be a perfect way to end the video. Let me go see what they're working with. Phil, we're good. <laughs> More fireworks going off. Oh, that was a good one. <laughs> They're cheering over there. Hell yeah. Good job, Phil. Good job. This thing is hot. The, did you hear the party uh, cheering over there? It's, yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're about to walk over there and see if there's any milk. Oh! It smells like fireworks inside the house now. It smells so bad. <laughs> um, I think that's it for the video, so. I left the tube outside. First did you really? Yes, I did. Are you, you gonna clean all, first, are you gonna clean all that up tomorrow morning? Took it out. Yeah, there's Tino told be, me to leave it outside. There's gonna be shit all over Good the place. Good job, Tino, first yeah. and foremost, but also, whatever. Well, I'm that's just trying it. to have everybody have a good time. Shout out to the Coleman Classic. Thanks Alice for having us today. 1 a.m. We got Oh yeah, her brother's coming. We gotta go pick him up. Oh, Adding thanks. a better character to the channel. It's been a crazy day, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and we'll see you all in the next one. Bye. Peace.